Oh. Forgot about time change. Yep. Good morning, Internet. Vlog cheating. Just a little bit. Happy birthday to a really good friend of mine. Good morning, Internet. It's, what, Monday now? And, well, I just got home. Back to work. My four days off are over. It's kind of sad now. I'm gonna eat, and then I'm going to clean my room, because believe me, it is dirty. You can pretty much see. I, I'm gonna try and, uh, there's all, there's a bunch of clothes there. My hamper's full. I gotta, I gotta get it done. Good morning, internet. Oh, come on. Rain. I was enjoying the niceness. Alright, we need to talk. This is gonna get a little political. So, Jeff, apologies if you don't like this, but it's not, it's not like, it's not, okay, sorry about that. It's not anything Trump related, Bernie Sanders related. It's, it's going to be a Democrat versus Republican kind of thing. Um, I'm going to change first though. All right. So here it goes. And it's kind of a rant too. So, you know, please, if you have any opinion on this, I want to hear it. So please leave a comment below. Um, and don't hate me for this, but, you know, it's, it's on my mind and it bugs me. And I, you know, I'm, I'm an open person. I'm an honest person and I love reading people's actual views, not the trolly stuff. Not trolling stuff, uh, like the one-line opinions. I like to read well-thought-out, uh, and just well-thought-out opinions on why certain stuff is whatever. But anyways, let's, let's, uh, begin. Basically, it's about climate change. Now, typically Republicans completely deny climate change exists or is real. Uh, Democrats, on the other hand, say, for the most part, this is, this is not everybody. Some people have different opinions or any, all that stuff, um, which we're going to get into that. But Democrats, typically, they're, they believe climate change is real, um, and they kind of talk about it that way. Uh, which, in the news, you'll see a lot of things about climate change. Uh, Leonardo DiCaprio, uh, in his speech, even mentioned it, that it's real and we need to work together to, you know, fix it. Well, that's the thing I'm curious about. If you're a Republican, please let me know, like, do you believe climate change is real do you have a different opinion like could climate change be a conspiracy by the government to i don't know tax us or something i don't know what is your opinion on it because in my opinion i think it uh, it is real i mean there's a thing that people have against science, for whatever reason, um, science typically tells us what's real and what's not. That's why science fiction is, you know, fake. But, you know, it's technically possible. I mean, there are things that we will likely never have in our lifetime, like teleportation and all that. But that's another story. Um, but yeah, just curious, like, if you're a Republican, if you're a Democrat, what, what's your views on climate change? Uh, it's, this wasn't really much of a rant because I, I guess it could have been. I didn't want to go rambling on for too long. This is already like two, three minutes <laughs> of me talking. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I think climate change is real and we need to work together to, you know, stop it. And based on 
all of the scientific facts that they've come up with, it's going to kill us. Or not maybe not us, but future generations, my kids, my kids' kids, that sort of thing. Uh, it's definitely something that I feel we should look ahead to and, you know, move to wind and solar energy uh, or other types of energy. Nuclear is not as bad as a lot of people make it out to be, but, you know, it has its potential for, you know, bad stuff. Look at Fukushima. Their nuclear power plant uh, pretty much destroyed a very large area around it after the earthquakes in, what, like 2012? So, yeah, there is a, a danger to it, but nuclear is relatively clean, it just takes a lot of water to keep things cool and, you know, people with knowledge, the engineers that run these places. But that's it. That's it for that. I'm, I'm done talking about that because I don't want to fill this vlog up with uh, too much stuff. But at least there was something to talk about, right? It's not just me saying, oh, hey, look, here's my, my uh, hallway. Boring. Okay, I know we're pretty much in the beginning of the vlog, but... So far, the highlight of my day has been watching a little bit of NASCAR and slightly fixing my bungee chair here because it kind of broke, if you notice the tape there. I can't exactly explain how it broke. I don't really know for a fact. What I do know is what it looked like. A little bolt came off of a part by the lock on the chair where it folds. The chair basically just was broken a few more times and it probably would have... I actually noticed it getting a little limp. I was like, this is weird. Any longer, it probably would have fallen on me. <laughs> Which would have been funny, of course, if it broke and completely fell apart while I was using it, because then I'd fall to the ground and yeah. I just explained that really weird, but trust me, it would have been funny if I fell with it. But I caught it just in time. We didn't exactly fix it, but we fixed it to the point it'll probably last a little bit longer than it was going to. Tightening up the bolt in a different spot a little bit better and then putting tape on it. <laughs> Not the best fix, but it'll work for a little while. Which makes me sad because I really do like that chair. I know it's just a chair. <sighs> I like how I'm acting like type from How I Met Your Mother with that meat and bag chair. It's a chair and I'm not going to get weird over it. I kind of already am, but, you know, regardless... It's an awesome chair. I don't know if any of you have any bungee chairs or not, but seriously an awesome chair. My dog is licking my ear. And it kind of hurts, but it tickles and it's really weird. Ah! And yes, I do slightly sound stopped up if you didn't notice yet. The nose, my nose part of my allergies is really affecting me right now today. It's just crazy. And unfortunately, my day is probably not going to get too much more interesting because my sister has been out today and she's probably going to be back pretty soon. And we're probably going to spend some major family time tonight because she's leaving tomorrow. Hey, what you doing? Grandma. Oh, sweet. All right, who's gonna guess how much I got done today? You're probably right. Pretty much nothing. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try and clean up a little bit and eat. And uh, yeah, tomorrow definitely gotta do some stuff. Uh, I'll probably get home a bit earlier tomorrow. Uh, which will help. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe, and we'll see you tomorrow. Have a good night, guys. Jeff out. But for today, I think that is all. So please, leave a like, a comment, or subscribe, or all three. Uh, we appreciate it if you do all three. Down below, and we'll see you tomorrow. Dylan out.